Hey guys, today we are going to be um, showing you the um, these gloves. What did you want? These gloves that we got, that my dad got from Bionic. Bionic. And they're to replace these old ones. Old ones I've had for years. The weight training gloves, weight lifting gloves, and um, it was on this company. Was on um, the winners on Dragon's Den, and a real bionic difference. Designed by leading orthopedic hand specialist, bionic gloves offer ergonomic technology that. Excuse me. Ergonomic technology that is wholly unique through patented features and top grade materials you will enjoy second skin comfort enhanced gripping power and durability that last a paint's meant to help to make your Bionic the world's most advanced gloves and yeah large selection so uh, these are my old gloves they were this leather bit here and they've got these little padded bits extra padded bits and bits where you want to get grip these bits here, so you can feel them, feel them vished. The cushion, squeeze. Daddy, can I jump? Yeah. Do you want to? Um, but it's kind of leather, and whenever it would go in the washing machine, it would come out all that bit slimy and stuff, so these would kind of dry out, and it did go a bit kind of rigid uh, with time. But I've had these for years, and they've been really good gloves, but they've started to wear bits of I just, just don't know if you see it, but the string and they start to drop. The ends are getting a bit worn. So they look a bit haggard, don't they? Yeah. And they also have these bits that when you wear them, I'll put one on. I'll put this one on to show you. So when you wore them, they would have these bits that would go kind of over your knuckles that are like a mesh. And then. Um, You've got these little grip bits and the bits where you grip extra padding where you'd normally grip the, the weights and it normally cause calluses or soreness. Quite comfortable, quite nice, nice gloves. They have got rigid, quite rigid here because this has gone, you know, it's, it's lost its softness with time, it's hardened up. And uh, like that, you see that, you can see that there with a the hold. So I just thought I'd get some more ones. They were discounted, these ones. I got them from the website there's a different design I want to get uh, but they only had these ones in my size so these are cross training gloves full finger premium fitness gloves medium size medium to the measuring guide as well and it says here so it's for you can use on um, machines machines kettlebells weights and cycling and it says natural fit tapered design confer con forms to finger shape so that's the information what you can use them for and then on the back it it one good thing that these don't have these don't have it's got touch screen technology well, you don't want it no i did one the other ones didn't have it oh. so full finger so it said full finger limit skin contact with equip gym equipment anatomical pad system for more grip and power fewer calluses and blisters that's the little pads um, that I talked about on these ones and then you've got touch screen technology which is pretty cool and polytile thumb that helps manage perspiration so I don't know if you <laughs> this bit here I'm not sure wipe your ears off Cold water, delicate wash, mild soap, no bleach product, cool, dry, flat. Maybe that's what I did. Maybe I wasn't doing cold water wash. Um, I was probably on 40, so that didn't help. Would help. And yeah. Sorry, stop doing that, please. Can't do a video. Um, so yeah, these are new design. So, should we get them open? Should I open, open them up? Not here, darling, please. Go on the other one. So, oh, same material as that So, you need to cut them off. I'll just pull them. So, the, these tags. So, so, the same. They've got the same. 
So these are the gloves. What do you think? They're basically the same. I no. think. No, they're, they're not. They're like... complete. A lot of differences in the design. <laughs> you got these open bits here. <laughs> Um, compared to that one, so they're kind of these open bits for the them to stretch around your hand. You've got a bit of an open bit here, um, the sides, the back of it. Nice, quite nice design. Although I would like preferred black and not these orangey bits, but it doesn't matter. You've got the same kind of bit you had there that go over the knuckles, yeah. And you've got this toweling bit here, like they mentioned. So the big, the, the bit that's for perspiration, you're wiping it off of your forehead or anywhere else. I don't know. Um, it's all across here, so it's kind of toweling, isn't it? That bit there. Yeah. That didn't have that. The other one didn't have that. The toweling bit. Huh? But this one doesn't have those knuckle bits. I don't think. Oh yeah, it does. It does have the knuckle opening but, like, bits. Not on the thumb. And then you've got this. <laughs> yeah, similar kind of material in between. But it's just on the black ones. You couldn't see it because it's all the same colour on these black ones. You're gonna try it on. You're gonna try one, yeah. So, um, what else is it say on the inside of the packaging? Get the inside of the packaging. Let's show everyone what it says the inside of the packaging. So, go on. So you got better grip, patented, patented pads help you burn the it's muscle groups before fatigue your forearms and hands. So. That? Is that they're talking about? Um, the padded part there. Quite cushioned. Yeah, if you look at the glove, that? that's just near the near the thumb part. I've got the left glove, haven't I? Oh, yeah, yeah. So near the thumb part. So that's the thing we're saying there. Mm. Um webbed web zones and motion zones to provide comfort and flexibility. So the web zones, these bits. The padded bits on the fingers, yeah? These bits. That is it, isn't it? Huh? I think so. And then you've got genuine leather palm is durable and supple. I think this one, the leather's the same. Yeah, with leather similar. <laughs> and you've got light preen wrist support, support, like a kind of neoprene bit here, which isn't the same. I think it is. Oh, okay, it is the I same. Like this one's old. I think this one's a lot stretchier. Ah, right. So the difference is on this one, the Velcro That's on the inside. was on the, on the on the on the inside, and the Velcro here is on the outside. I think that's better. It doesn't get in the way. So they've made some nice design, and then obviously you've got these this bit, isn't it, for um, for when you're using it on, you know, for um, mm. the what do you call it? Um, the thing, the touch screen technology, so it's on the thumb Only the and the thumb. index finger. Oh yeah, it's on the uh, index finger. finger, yeah. Is it like, the, just like fake leather the touch screen bit? Touch screen is a different material, so you can actually use it, isn't it? So, um, the other thing what it says, so you've got these bits here giving you information, which obviously you're buying it online, so you won't get all this information, it just comes with the packaging. So like, it's telling you about all the different parts of um, what it has. So that's what we've just gone through. <laughs> so the padded bit there, you've got the light, what it says, light preen wrist, which is like a neoprene bit. There you've got the web zones and motion zones. And then you've got genuine leather palm Antibacterial treatment helps control odour in your gloves. Something smelly and pongy. Um, so men's glove chart place wrist. It just tells you how to measure the, the measuring thing, how to measure the size you need. This measure, it's got a bit of information about how to measure it, which is um, place wrist crease closest to your palm at the bottom edge of this package. Ah. Oh right, that's really clever. Look, measuring. So if you buy this in a shop, you're gonna measure which one is exactly right for you. So you put your hand there and then you measure it and I'm a medium, you see? Because I've covered up the... How do you do that if you don't 
Yeah, I know if you're not buying online, see what you're at, see where you are. You're small. So you could actually get these gloves so they did fit you. No, I'm medium. No, you have to be covering the medium bit. You have to cover it, cover yeah. M. Yeah, M, M. Place your wrist crease closest palm to the closest to your palm at the bottom edge of the package where the tip of your middle finger forward indicates the size of your finger gloves should have a snug comfortable fit you're just about small i think medium would be a bit too big for you yeah so you're 14 do you could get these gloves um so let me just try them on just try them on no, don't be really going to fall Um, do you want to go and t quickly tell him? So, um, right. <clears throat> so I pulled it up. So I put the glove on, and I've got to say it's quite a tight fit. It says it should be a snug fit. This is a very snug fit. Actual fact, my fingers aren't quite meeting the ends here because it's so tight. Um, I think large would have been a bit too big. So I think it will stretch a bit because it is leather and cloth. Um, so unlike, if I, if I put this old one on, compared to the old one, which you probably won't be able to get anyway, you can't get anyway, this old one here. Um, actually, that bionic bit's coming off the, even the um, the uh, little badge is coming off. Um, these are stretched a bit more, so they better come same same size. You can see, you know, difference. When I close, it feels a lot more tight and snug on my fingers, um, and. You've got that one that way around there, and the uh, on the other side, it's it's the the Velcro tab bit is on the top on on the new one is on the bottom of that one, which may have got in the way when you're doing stuff. You're generally gripping this hand. Um, I was just saying um, while you're gone, it's really snug, very tight, not very tight and uncomfortable, but very snug. Mm. But you can see the bits that you grab. Yeah, bits. yeah. So yeah, so these. These bits, you can see these bits. If I'm not sure, I see that this, these bits are sticking out, and they're a lot more well pronounced than these ones. Well, you can feel them. These are a lot more, and they've got this kind of webbed kind of design, which probably give you more grip. How does that feel? This one. Yeah, the, the web bit. Is it quite grippy, sticky? Not yeah. really. It's a bit like a bit of stickiness to it. So um, it looks pretty good. <laughs> What I may just do, let me just, should I just get my one of my bars, one of my weights bars and see what it's like? Yeah. Huh? Yeah. Maybe I'll just quickly do that, so, yeah, one second. weights here and I'm just going to try grippiness yeah it's a lot more padding on that one you can still get protection padding on this one but you can feel it a lot more you know kind of nice when you're grabbing it hard when I'm gripping you can feel the pads are kind of is that your hand? yeah yeah, it's come through here as well, you see? So definitely a new pair, you see there's the old one. Um, but you can feel, you can feel more of your, it's more coming through the glove when you hold it with this one, or with this one, you can feel when you squeeze tight, you feel the ped, pads compressing, but they're providing a lot more protection. That may be because this is just worn down, or the pads are thick on this, but definitely it feels nice and comfortable in my hands get quite sore these days so I needed this just to give extra protection for me to lift my weights I'm not lifting mad crazy heavy weights but I want to still lift weights so I wanted something to give my hands a bit more protection um, you've got this hole here here on the old one knuckles exposed 
here they similar thing but you've got more areas here as well maybe just to stop you maybe be able to get a bit of you know um, ventilation for your hands possibly but I think it's really great that you can um, I'll be able to use my phone as well because if you're following something on your phone maybe a training routine you want to still be able to use the phone and not have to take your um, gloves off when you have to swipe across or do something with your phone so that's a major advantage of this compared to this because you see these pads finger pads the same material whereas on this one it's not so that's where you can use it for your phone so yeah um quite tight i think they're kind of you know, breaking in just stretch needs a bit of stretching yeah breaking or stretching whatever you want to call it i don't mind the design actually it's actually okay i know what you think what do you think of the design yeah. Uh, if they switch the colours, if that one was white and that one was black, I think it would be better. So the other way, black on the outside. Yeah, like these ones. You prefer this? I do prefer this kind of design. <laughs> if this was all black, but and the orangey bits, I'm not too overly keen on the orangey bits. What do you think? Mm. No. No. Um, I'm gonna use it inside. Not really kind of use that gym. I use it inside when I train inside. Let's just start going to gym again. But, um, but yeah, I, I think it's okay. I, I don't think it's anything major. It's gonna people can laugh at it or anything. But yeah, so they they're pretty comfortable, really comfortable. They feel a bit tight, but I'm sure they're gonna break in nicely like these did. These have done me great. I've had these for years. They're a brilliant pair of gloves. Really nice really good quality I think it's worth getting I think they're about I put a link in I put uh, a link to the uh, these particular ones how much were they had a discount code so I think they worked out to about 18 or 19 pounds but well worth it because I think your Nike yeah. football ones were your field playing gloves were about 19 pounds weren't they yeah. your Nike football one uh, football ones and <laughs> these are superb these are really good really good gloves you can wear them normal gloves to be quite honest or when you if you wanted to if you're doing like work like things like gardening stuff when you have to grip things your hands do hurt but then mm. it'd be a shame because you're ruining not ruining a nice pair of gloves but then you'd be using for mucky stuff but same at the gym i suppose if you're going to a gym unless you're only using your unclean gym equipment they're going to get a bit mucky as well but it provides a lot of protection for your hands i say long term having trained mm. many years on and off that you know you do sh if you want to, your hand to be in good condition long term you do need to wear some gloves to protect them, I'd say. Yeah, you, know, you don't know what you're picking up from other people's gloves, not other people using weights and stuff as well, what they've been, how clean they keep, how hygienic they are, how clean them, they clean they are, so you don't know what you're going to be picking up. I don't mean in a bad way. Or you can just wear, obviously, bare hands and wash your hands after your training session, but these will protect your hands from calluses, blisters, cuts, and things like that. It's really good, really solid really durable really nice they have you know improved the design you know i think it's a better glove i think i'll get another good couple of years out of these as well hopefully so it'll be worth it it's worth the money definitely yeah. so yeah yeah so you know. uh, please like this video and subscribe to my channel and i will see you next time peace out Bye.